how to make a prevision of our series. So to make a prevision of, on, of our series, uh, we need to uh, first of all extend the range of our series. So we came up on our base and double click on the range and change end dates. So we could even uh, say that uh, the end date was were previously uh, April the 24, 2020. So we can extend to uh, May the 1st, May the 1st, 2020 then click on OK and then click on OK to, uh, to resize involving inserting uh, five observation then click on yes to continue and apply for, uh, as well for the program so our uh, series has been extended so we can if we go on the spreadsheet you should see that uh, there are uh, one, two, three, four, five new value that has been extended to our series. So to make a prevision, as I told you, you just need to go on uh, forecast and give the name. Uh, you can edit the name of the forecast series. So we should choose a uh, lab dynamic forecast and in uh, forecast sample should uh, start at uh, April the 25th April the 25th because previously our series were ended in April the 24th so uh, now we uh, start broadcasting at April the 25th 2020 till uh, May the 1st, 2020. So then we click on OK and you can see that our series uh, focus has been made. So we can select uh, so we can select our two series closing and closing focus and then open as group. Double click and open as group so we can uh, go on view, plot the uh, graph of our series and we can see the uh, forecasting forecast series which is in blue and the series evolution in red so we can see that uh, our model have been uh, have been used in order to forecast that uh, our series is going to uh, go up in the few uh, in the few days. So uh, if you are a trader, you should uh, you should buy uh, the money. You should buy uh, dollar so that uh, in the few days the value of the dollar should go up and you should sell when the price will uh, will reach a, a good level. So that's it for this tutorial.